Hello everybody and welcome to my 60 second VBA 2010 tutorial and this tutorial is going to show you how to uh, include attachments on your emails when you send them through VBA. So uh, I just want to quickly show you uh, if you don't want to use the references for Microsoft Outlook so I haven't got it activated here uh, you can use you can just declare these as objects uh, and object and then when you do, when you do this bit don't put new put create object and then put the outlook application in brackets uh, and what this allows you to do is it just means that you don't have to tick that reference and it means that if you send it on to anyone else then they won't have to worry about the reference being ticked either. Uh, so if you're sending it out to a lot of people I found that generally this way is better. The disadvantage is when we're using our dot etc you don't actually get any prompts uh, and also it's more efficient if you're using the reference library in certain cases. But this I generally use just because it resolves quite a lot of problems when you send it out to lots of people. Um, so let's just update this to my actual email because um, I changed it to email at server for the when I saved it as an example. Uh, Hotmail.co.uk. Uh, uh, when I mention examples, um, if you go on to the website that you can get to by being on any one of the videos or go into my channel page and then going onto the official website uh, and uh, when it loads up just scroll down underneath any of the videos and click on this download button and it will download in a zip file all of the tutorials that I've been doing for you uh, so that's really useful. Uh, if you want to be looking at the code as you go along, then feel free. Um, so if, if we want to add an attachment in now, uh, then before we send it, just go to dot attachments and then dot add. And then you want to put in the uh, file path of the file you want to add in. So I'm just going to add in uh, this workbook dot path ampersand backslash ampersand this workbook dot name. So I'm going to send the the workbook that I've got open. Um, so before I do that, I'm also just going to go this workbook dot save. Uh, and then I'm going to press play on this uh, and it's going to try and send an email again and I'm, just, I'm going to wait for it to load up and then I'm going to press allow uh, and then when I go onto my email on here uh, and I'll have a beautiful new email through from myself uh, and it will have the tutorial 62 example file um, and apparently Ross is uh, ready and he's going to go onto Xbox which is great um, <laughs> and uh, you can uh, it will have that attachment you can keep adding them you can add as many as you want and you don't have to only attach Excel files or the current file you can put in any directory in there that you well any directory that you can attach to an email file so that's how you attach files and that's going to be it for this tutorial and also going to be it on sending emails. Uh, in the next tutorial I'm going to show you how you would control other applications using send keys uh, and app activate. So thanks for listening and I hope to catch you soon.